Hello everyone, my name is Justin, this is our Gutless Life. Welcome back. What up my witchers? The Witcher Enhanced Edition. And we need to escort Gramps here to a shrine to pray. Uh, we just cleared out the uh, buildings and talked to everyone there, I think. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna play with these drowners. And... Gramps is trash talking. But I don't know exactly what he said. Oh, get, there's that little boy hanging out with the drowners. That seems like a really bad idea there, buddy. And there's quite a bit of them. Five? Six? That's fine. Oh, that drowner didn't have a brain? That's unfortunate for drowner. Oh. Two of those drowners didn't have anything to pick up. Weird. All right. These boggy holes must be clay pits. Clay. Uh oh. What's going on? Clay pits. This is where those lunatics work. Are they gonna murder uh, me while we they talk? Look normal to me. Brickmakers pretend to be normal to strangers, yet they conceal their faith. You know those dimwits worship fish people? Uh, I guess People believe it. in the strangest things. Yeah, but to worship slime-covered reptiles with bulging eyes. <laughs> Look at their eyes! I mean, those Volianoi can't even talk. You must communicate Voidianoid. with them using objects. Care to elaborate? Humans communicate with fishoids by leaving objects on special altars. Each item has specific symbolic meaning, and is read... His hand intense. was super creepy looking. The Volianoi answer in the same manner. What kind of objects? Don't know when I don't care. You need to speak with one of the worshippers. But brickmakers don't divulge their knowledge to potential blasphemers. I get that. Oh boy. Careful with all of the drowners. Oh, that wasn't so bad at all. Let's do that again. Come on, everyone. I hope Gramps isn't murdered. Oh, sweet. That wasn't so bad at all. Uh, it's weird that not every drowner has a mutable thing. It's very weird. And Gramps, next time we are about to engage in combat, combat, don't, uh, don't talk to me. The lords are coming. Shove off. What? Who's above the lords? What is this crap? Well, I will fall on my face into dust. If they're the under the water, like most everybody is above the lords. Hey. They ascend like kings to the throne. You want nice a hat. I call thee from the depths. Come. What the hell? For I tell thee, who is above the lords? He stuck a feather in his cap and called it macaroni. I will fall on my face. Hey, they you want what? Why am I threatening to beat up a kid who is saying little prayers? That seems mean of me. So, they worship uh, deep ones. Look at that pretty girl. It's like a octopus squid fish with boobies. Because that makes sense. Oh, what's going on here? Salamander brooch. Split salamander brooch. The blow that killed the bandit split the brooch in two. Only a witcher's sword could have done this. Berengar is dead. Sad tidings for Vesemir when I see him again. This mutilated corpse. The monsters have torn a lot of flesh from this corpse. It's obvious the mortal wounds were inflicted by sword. A sharp one at that. Okay, I can't loot him. All right, uh, we don't want to leave anything for the vo Vodianoi yet, if ever. It's the stone golem. I think, yeah, that's the shrine in Melatelli we need to get to. And I think we did all of that. Okay, we're doing well. I feel a little uh, claustrophobic. It's 
the uh, blood swagger on there can be very bad. It explodes when it dies, and you want to get the heck away from it. Super fast. Uh oh. I think it. Wait, what did, what did it do to me? It stunned me with something. Oh, run away before it explodes. Oh, oh hey, drowned dead. Those are special. They're. A lot tougher than drowners, too. Let's do a stun on it. Okay, good. That worked. Cramps, you have an axe. Okay. Not so fast, son. Okay. I think I need ten. Ten tons. And now we wander around sticking our hand in the swamp at random piles of goo. Those blood swaggers. I don't know if that's actually their name. Yeah. They spit acid or poison or something. And then when they die, they like writhe around and then explode. Sephira and Abba is merged. Spells still work. Hey, the old spells still work. Sweet. We don't have any fools. Parsley. Come, come on, attack or something. You're just kind of standing there. Oh, crap. Run away, Gramps. That, uh... I think, did I kill it? That, uh... plant... monster... was really, really doing damage to me. Oh, that's right, I was gonna put on my... Uh, Argentia. Increases the damage of silver swords. Yeah. Damage inflicted by 60%. Holy crap, Olo. That's freaking awesome. All right. It's now that the plant. Okay. We can either burn it and then chop the heck out of it. Oh my gosh. Run away! Ah, shoot! Oh, it's a special... It's a special named plant. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Ah, shoot. When was the last time you saved? I don't... Was it after the pits or before the pits? It was at the pits. Okay. Well, shoot. You know what? That's fine. And then we can put on our silver sword increase. 60% for... I don't remember how many hours that was. 24 hours. Ooh. Ooh. Mama like. That's great. So, oh, we need to kill the blood swagger again. What? Oh, no, it moved. Mm. Holy crap. Uh, is it? Moving under the ground? We need to be way more careful with that. And I didn't mean to stun it. I tried to put to my fire. 
All right. Third time's the turn. And you can't ever have enough plants to pick. I don't think I need any more Celandine or oh, wrong button or white myrtle, but we're doing it anyway. Put on. Let's do a little save here. Where are you? The fire does so much damage to it. There we go. 2,000 experience points. Hachi Machi. That was an Archospor. And we can get... Uh, so it was a super... A super... Uh, a jigger. I don't remember what these things... The oh, gosh! The sword is doing so much damage. It's freaking awesome. When these explode, you can actually get them to kill everything around them. Like that. Yeah. This... <laughs> this sword oil is kicking so much butt. Man. Oh, gosh. I was appreciating myself. That's what happens when you appreciate yourself. You can go blind. Oh, Gramps. Three islands they call this place. A plant called Celandine flourishes here. I have a you bunch of it about herbs. in my pocket. Well, I'm no herbalist, but I read much in my youth. For example, two doses of Celandine combined with nasen salts produces a bomb that instills magic fear. Useful. You holds a blood he has magic a fear swamp. on him you currently. Two doses of their blood, mix it with abomination lymph and echinop spores, you create a potion the druids call Maribor Forest. Know any other uses for herbs? Damnable old age. I may remember later. You're helpful. You're old, Gramps. Yeah, you're getting really old, Gramps. Okay. I mean, that was a weird update, but we'll do it. I'm super impressed that I was... The obelisk seems ancient. Sephira and the obelisk emerged. I'm very impressed that the fire did so much damage to that Echinops Archospore. Alright. Save more often in the swamp. Oh, we didn't get very far at all. Holy moly, did the last obelisk do this? That's hecka impressive. I don't... Can Drown Deads be taken out with... Nope. You have to be... Kitty Cat. C Stop running everywhere, Pops. I mean, Gramps. Sorry, I forgot... Who you were to me. I think that's a... Power... Source. It is a power source. And we're gonna draw from it. What? You can teleport right back home. That is that is good to know. So yeah, the other obelisk did it. Look at that. Dragon Ball Z stuff. Sweet. So we need to put something in here. We probably don't have... Oh, we don't have that one. That's for sure. It's a Fenoid. Come on, explode and hurt everybody, please. Roy! Yeah. 
they do acid stuff. Pups or cramps or something. I'm having I'm having some movement problems. That's right. Everybody run away. Sweet! We're doing it. We're doing it nine times. We need ten, ten tons. We got our ten tons. Great. And then we need, well, we need more than ten tons. Come on, everybody. Group up so I can kill you all. Whoa! That was so much damage. Good job, sword. Enough. Come on, enough. Stop throwing a fit every time an enemy shows up. I'm getting very obnoxious. And then sweet Hellebore. And then Fenoed. It's an elven plant. Uh, it means... Uh, uh, something. Oh boy, we got... <laughs> we got far away from... Excuse me, where we needed to go. We're going on back. With our kitty cat sword out. I don't know why we're running so fast, though. I say kitty cat sword because that's what the... Icon looks like for, for this one. It's a cat. Wolf, cat, and eagle. In case you were wondering. And while you're wondering about that, please subscribe. Oh man, we're back to the pits. <laughs> this swamp is going to be a lot of wandering. Okay, we don't want to go over there. Crow's eye, yes, please. Enough. Gramps, shut up. Enough. Wow, they are coming out of the swamp. <laughs> it's not really letting me attack. Yeah. Sometimes when you try to do a group attack on one that's not, like, fully ready, like, they pop out of the swamp, but they're not ready to be engaged. They need a little time to, like, I guess zone in. Why can't I loot that? Uh, then your whole attack fails and you just kind of stand there. Alright, is there anything you want to say about over here, Gramps? I feel like I need a... Uh, like a ranged weapon to uh, pull these guys. Oh, this is going to be too many. Or the perfect amount. Come on. Attack, please. The silver sword doing 60% more damage is just tearing through these guys. It is really impressive. <laughs> that that was awesome. I really enjoyed that. And our Swallow Potion is doing a good job of keeping us alive. I hope. Careful Drowned Dead, don't do anything. Quibeth. 
rebirth, I should say. That's actually pretty darn good. Uh, vitriol. I don't actually think I need... Ah, Echinops! Echinops can be a problem. At least... Actually, I think it goes Echinops and then Archospores. So, Echinops are the little ones. What was I saying? I don't think I need... Crow's eyes very much, but I do need Beggar Tick, Fenoed. Oh, hey, these things next to a cave entrance means there's a lot of dead bodies here. Gramps, do you want to say anything about a cave? Oh, yes, you do. I rarely go near that cave. It's the lair of wild dogs. Wild dogs in the swamp? And the hounds feed on carrion. I don't but they you. rarely scorn fresh meat. I heard them howl at night as they hunt in packs. I had a bad dog experience recently. Think I'll skip visiting the cave. <laughs> a tale may change it's a funny your mind. joke. Local legend claims the tomb of a famous Vran warrior lies in the deepest parts of the cavern. Some say a vast treasure lies with him. Oh, heck, I'm gonna go in there then. Treasure. Folks tell the strangest tales, all varying, save for one point. What's that? All who sought the treasure vanished. Dun dun dun. Who were the friends? Were, for they're nearly extinct. Well, I know little about them. Not even where they accumulated treasures. Oh, is it a race? Let's move on. Hmm. Come here, drowned dead. And I've got some fire for you. How have we not leveled like 16 times already? Also, where the hell are we? There's the shrine of Melatelli. Sorry, sorry, Gramps. Yeah, I'm okay. We were near this and then we ran away because of all the blood wisers. Come on. Are you gonna explode? Because I don't want to be here for that. And then it can start. The, their explosions can start a chain reaction. Come on, attack, please. Run away. See, that one exploded, which hurt that one. I can't tell what sword this needs, whether it needs strong or uh, fast. Oh, there's a corpse over there. And we really should look to see what these give. Oh, vermilion. Oh, yes please, yes please. Okay, let's go let's go get the corpse real quick. I don't think we've been to this island. Oh. We have not, because this is where the golems hang out. Oh, Tipperoth. I think we just bought that one. From Luvardin. This really is a... Gramps? Where are you? Witcher's callings, wandering through stinky, gross places, killing monsters so that humans are safe. Come on. There you go. Just go ahead. Everybody line up. You'll all get some. There's frogs at my feet. It's pretty cute. Come on. Loot, loot the brains, please. 
We just bought this for 500. The Fira and Obelisk merged. The old spells still work. They sure do. Geralt, please say that every time we do that. We have to put it in <laughs> 10 of them? Oh my gosh, where are we? That's where the golems are. Just. So let's just get, get rid of Grandpa. It's time. Time for Grandpa to go away. Here we are. Thank you, son. You're welcome. I'm not your son. I like you. Visit me sometime. I'll show you my books, serve you some tea, and goulash. You're a witcher, yes? What well, do you make? I'm another goulash one. friend recently, but he lacked courtesy. He demanded to know about the Circle of Elements. Ooh. Circle of Elements? Another witcher? What can you tell me about him? Well, not much, son. He wanted about asking questions. I'm not your I'm son. looking like one with a sour stomach. I'm not so interested in that. Yeah, I know, I know. He feared something or someone. Spent most of his time near the pits where those village idiots burrow in clay. Thanks, Gramps. That helps. We... We already talked about that. Oh, I wanted to ask you about the Circle of Elements. Now I need to pray in peace. Well, shoot. I guess we're not going to talk about the Circle of Elements. I guess we'll find it on our own. Very lemon. This reminds me of something. There's an altar at the base. You give her food, she gives you mistletoe. We already got the three stones from her. Oh, he gave us uh, some potions. Or picked them up somewhere. We don't need these. Makes hidden opponents invisible. Or makes hidden opponents visible. That kind of makes me nervous. What hidden opponents are there going to be there, buddy? Alright, we're going to go to the cave. And we're going to play around in there. We gained a level. We'll level up at some point. Yeah, I know I ran past the cave. I just wanted to see... Man, I felt like I went miles in this swamp, but it's just the same 10 feet I'm going <laughs> going back over and over again. All right. Wolves! What? So, like, uh, Megadogs, what sword should I be using? Okay. Big attack with silver sword seems to work just fine. Although, I wonder if a steel sword would be better. No, probably not, because the silver sword does 60% more damage. Oh, I want those mushrooms! Come here, wolf. Yeah, the Silver Sword is doing it. One experience point. So, killing the helpless dogs in the village was better. Whoa! That is quite a lot of damage there, creatures. Maybe not as much as I thought. Somebody needed uh, wolf belts. Was it Jean Pierre? We're gonna get him. Oh, a wraith. Let's save. Come here, wraith. No, oh, you need the kitty cat. Can you be lit on fire? Oh, you can! That 
was a lot of experience for that. I found the circle of elements. Ouch! That was rude. Interrupted by Wolfie. I hear Wolfie barking. Wolfie's just fine, son. Wolfie's just fine. Where are you? Name that movie in the comments. Also, subscribe. Whoa, whoa. Where'd that wolf come from? It's like a phoenix rising out of the ashes with the other wolf. Take that, Wolfie. Alright, we need to loot the wolves. Wolves. Circle of Elements. I've learned the defensive q -in sign. q on q -in. The sign will block all attacks and protect you from damage. Choose a sign on the left of the screen. Right-click to cast the sign. q on disappears when you cast another sign or attack an opponent. It is best used to gain time to drink potions during combat. Weird? So it was a temporary buff of protection. Oh, sweet. A Sephira. Sephira. A sword and an axe. I now have seven Sephira. Sephira. And we don't need that. Beast liver. Just the liver. I want to level up, but I don't want to lose my oil on my sword. I guess I can always make more. I've got a ton of this stuff. And I killed a bunch of doggos. Let's try it. Sweet! Blocks all damage and it goes away when I attack. That is a good emergency spell. I'm going to think about putting points in that. Oh! A wolf from nowhere. Maybe he's hiding in the shadows. Sometimes uh, enemies are hidden, just like that potion. Why can't I pick you? That uh, potion reveals hidden opponents. Sometimes enemies are hidden, and you can't see them until you're right up on them, or they attack you. I think that's it for this cave. And I think we come back in here because this looks like a... I can't loot it. So this looks like a quest area. Anyway, my name is Justin. This is Our Godless Life. Thank you for watching. Please remember to subscribe and uh, leave me a comment. Tell me about how much you miss Rachel. I miss her too. We're not separated or anything. She's just not here while I'm recording this. All right, and then we will resume with next The Witcher. I don't have an end to that sentence. When next The Witcher. That's where I'm going to leave it. Okay, thanks everyone. Bye.